Hey everyone, it's Thisby and welcome back to my channel. I am so excited. We have two pixlings and two zombies for Ethel. Now I did not intend to get any of these when I went to the store, but the zombies for Ethel were actually on clearance for $5 each, which I thought was a steal. So I figured that we could try it again to get the one that I really, really wanted, which is cold hearted right here. So we'll see if we can get her. But more importantly, we have Pixlings. I love Pixlings. I actually already have Mira, who is right here. She's not one that I originally wanted, but she really has grown on me. And I just think that fashion dolls are so cute. I love any kind of ball jointed doll as well. I love that she can move. So when I went to Walmart and I saw that they had the exclusive um, like pixie little fairy, I had to get her. I think that she is so gorgeous and this packaging is amazing. It is all decorated up with butterflies. The little gem on the front is pink and glittery and so is the jewel on the top. So we are going to be opening her. We are going to be opening this pixling and also these zombies all in one video. And I think this is the most I've opened in one video, so I am extra, extra, extra excited. I think I'm going to start with one of the regular pixlings and then I'll do both of the zombies and then we will end off with the exclusive um, fairy pixling. So with that being said, let us grab our first blind box and get started. All right, so we are going to open up our first pixling. I am absolutely in love with these and I've been so excited to get another one. I can't wait to see which one I got. Let's try and crack this open. You know, I love the way that fake nails look, but it is so much easier to open things up without them. Um, let us take a look and see what is in here. They come with guides in multiple languages, which I think is great. So here is the English one, which is what I need. And I think I did this in the wrong order last time. So this time <laughs> we're going to check and make sure that I don't do that. It says to place it on a plate for easy cleanup. Um, I'm not going to do that. I am going to just pray <laughs> that I don't screw it up. Okay, so the first thing is taking off the little plastic part on the front, and then we have to get the Pixling Power Elixir. So let me pull that top tab off, and we will cut the Power Elixir open. All right, so here is the power elixir. I spilled this horribly last time, so I'm going to try to um, not do that this time. Let's cut it open. I have some little scissors today. I can't find my large ones, <laughs> so these ones will work. I don't know about you guys, but I still have no idea how these work. Um, I guess this liquid just dissolves in water after a while, but still, it beats me. Okay, I think that's everything. Now it is time to fill the potion bottle up to the fill line. One of my favorite cups to do that. Right. Here we go. Okay, so here it is filled up. You can see some of that liquid is swirling around in there. Okay, so the next step is adding ingredient number four, which is this little thing right here. Oh, 
planet. So there's a bunch of little stars. So cute. We are just going to drop those in. And we have to add in the magic elixir. This is super dark compared to the one that I had from Mira. There's not much like swirling happening in here, but still really pretty. Okay, and the last step is adding ingredient number six. Let's pop that in really quick. No, <laughs> I ripped the horn. That's okay. There's the horn put together. Let's drop that in. And now, time to open that golden ring and reveal the magic words. And of course, it says Magicus Mixus. So we are going to turn the gem until it stops. Let me push down hard twice. And now we wait. I'm so excited. Apparently this takes about a minute. Let's hold her up and uh, see the magic happen. There's her little feet. You guys, this is so exciting. This is why I love these things. There's such an element of whimsy to them, but the toys are so beautiful. I cannot wait to take her out. Okay, so we didn't get completely clear, um, but I genuinely can't wait no longer. So we are going to crack this open and take out Miss Unia. All right, here she is. I just dried her off a little bit, but let's take this plastic part out. I legitimately cannot handle how cute she is. She has this adorable little ponytail and this gorgeous multicolored hair, these giant ears, and look at her little unicorn horn. If you've seen my avatar or if you've seen me, <laughs> um, you'll know that I love unicorns. So when I saw her, it was really love at first sight. I love that the arms on these guys are kind of articulated. It's definitely not perfect, but I mean, look at them, they're just so cute. I love her little wings. If you see up close, there are tiny little stars on them and she has this nice glittery shirt. Her shoes even have little tiny wings on the side. She's really cute from the back too. And look at her makeup. Oh my goodness. So underneath her eyes, there are these little tiny wings with these stars and she has beautiful blush. I just love her. And we are going to put her on her stand. So just give me one sec. So the little gold cap is actually their stand. Here it is. It says Pixlings on it and she will just slot on. And here she is. I am so in love with her. Um, I think that she's just beautiful. And next to Mira. I mean, these guys are just so cute. Look at them. I cannot wait to have a whole set of these, and I'm really glad that they're adding to the line because um, these are some of my favorite, like, smaller balls to come out in a while. So let's stand her up and move on to our first zombie. All right, so here is a zombie forever. You guys know the drill with these. I just opened a couple. We got, I think, Miss Everlasting and then also Shop Till You Drop. I actually have Miss Everlasting just up above me right here, and then Shop Till You Drop is higher up. I will have to insert a clip of my toy shelf so that you guys can see what I'm talking about. I'm kind of already out of room, <laughs> so 
I don't know what I'm going to do with some of these, but whatever. It's fine. I just love toy collecting. So without further ado, let's crack this open and see what we got. We have all of the cardboard off. Let's crack this open. As per usual, I am going to grab the collector's guide and the stickers just so that we don't get spoiled on who it is. Um, we will open up the doll first, then the accessories, then the collector's card, and we'll take a look at the stickers. Okay, let's go. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we totally got cold hearted. Look at how cool she is. I love that she is like translucent bodied. That is so neat. And she has this great ombre hair. And then her eyes are like little tiny snowflakes. Okay, let us grab her accessories bag, get her dressed, and then take a look at her collector's card. All right, so I have the difficult part of her clothing to get on <laughs> on her body. She has this really cute little skirt with an apron. And then she also has this ice cream for her hand. Well, she's supposed to just hold it, but at least for me, it's not really staying in there. Oh, there we go. And finally, we have her really cute little hat. Okay, so here is Cold Hearted. I really like her. I think that she's probably my favorite so far. Um, there's just something about her that really amuses me. And I just realized she actually has like ice cube hair ties. <laughs> so that's adorable. But let's pop her on her stand and then we will move on to the next song bay. I can't believe I almost forgot. Here is the little sticker sheet. She's holding an ice cream cone in her hand. This is super duper cute. And of course, we also have the collector's card, so let's crack this open. Look at how cute this card is. You can really see the character art, like kind of their intention. She has this like, you know how when characters are cold, they'll have like squiggly lines next to them. That's what her hair reminds me of and her feet are frozen. <laughs> this is so cute. I cannot wait to add this to my stack of collector's cards for these along with the stickers. Okay, let us move on to the next one for real. Okay, here is our next sound base forever. I think this is probably the last one I'm going to get of these. I think seeing them come on clearance means that they won't really be around as much anymore. But let us open this. So we got So Shady. I cannot wait to open up her accessories because I know that she comes with like a little umbrella. So anyways, let me grab that really quick. Okay, so here is her umbrella. It has a little bat on top and it actually spins. So I think I will be amused by this forever. And we also have her skirt. It's like a peplum skirt. Pretty cute. And of course her sunglasses. And before we get her dressed, let's take a look at the doll. So she has little tiny bats in her eyes. I like that she's kind of like a vampire zombie. I don't know. It's pretty neat. Okay. I won't lie. That was a battle <laughs> to get her on here, but here she is. I like her little umbrella. 
this one is really cute. I wasn't too sure about her at first, but I think she's kind of grown on me. So let's take a look at her stickers and her card as well. Okay, so here are her stickers. She has this like little tiny calendar with different dates. A lot of them have boys in them. So here's her little boyfriend, I guess, and she is holding her signature shades. Really cute. And here is her collector's card. And this one is cool. I love her expression. This is so well drawn. I actually did forget to check on the last one, but let's take a look here. So she likes bats and moons, and she hates the sun and garlic. Okay, and here's the back of Cold Hearted. She likes cold drinks and ice cream and hates vegetables and bugs. So here are the cards I have all together. Really cute. I love that they're holographic. Um, I will have to find a way to display these. I like that this one's a different color. That's super nice. Okay, so with all the zombies open and after your meal has been open, it is time for what I think is the main event. This exclusive uh, Magic Mixie Pixling. Now, I actually do not know what her name is. I just know that the doll is adorable. This packaging is adorable and I am ready to crack it open. So let's get going. Um, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, when I opened this, <laughs> she was actually already turned around, so I'm sorry if there's a hard cut, but I switched her back really quick, and I will open her for real with all of you. So let's take off these rubber bands. Clean the plastic up here. Okay, so we almost just had a complete disaster in Mixieland. I'm really glad I got this towel. Um, not for her, for me. Something was up with the mechanism and it just wasn't put on properly. So when I opened it, she popped open and then it wouldn't close again. I tried not to look at it for too long, um, but we are going to get this potion started because I'm ready to get her out of there. Sorry about any background noise. That is my cat from Wonderful Playtime and I do not want to stop him. I seriously have no idea how to open these so I don't chop stuff open, so we're just going to go for it. So we have these really cute little sparkles. Let's drop all those in. Okay, time for the last bit of the potion. Hi, Mango. This is a really cute little fairy ring. <laughs> I love it. He always likes to come see what I'm doing. Okay, we're not going to take him any money here, though. No, he gets to hang out whenever he wants. So I am going to drop this in once he moves his tail. <laughs> All right, the tab in the back already got pulled off just while some issues were happening, but that's okay. We are going to join the gym. And then push two times. And now we wait. All right, I think that's good enough, don't you? Again, I don't know what it is, but this is a struggle. She does not want to come home to me, but here she is, so let's get her out. All right, so here she is. Honestly, I have to say this might be my favorite. They're all beautiful, but this kind of special edition one 
she is just gorgeous i mean look at her hair these kind of like little pigtails and she has these beautiful wings yeah this is a great doll if we take a close look at her face oh my goodness it's like little butterfly wing eye makeup and she has the same sort of blush that the other ones do i love these shoes too the little butterfly wings very trendy and her kind of tutu and of course obsessed with these little antennae up here and how her bangs are styled around them and she also has these really cute little ears that have the butterfly wings on them yeah despite all the troubles that she gave me i'm obsessed with her okay i took a closer look at the little collector's guide so her name is flitta and she is the butterfly pixling so what she says here, her potion power is luck and fortune. If you ever find yourself in a flutter, Flutter the Butterfly Pixing will use her power of fortune to turn your day from bad to good in an instant. With a sprinkle of Flitta's oh so lucky potion, things can only get better. That is cute. Okay, so here are all the dolls together. Just look at them. I am super duper happy with the stuff that we unboxed today. I really, really like the zombies. I'm especially glad that I got my little ice cream parlor girl and, of course, my Pixlings. I almost have a complete set of these now. I just have the dear one left. I think I might wait until the winter-themed rabbit comes out and then get them together and open them. Anyways, thank you guys so much for joining me today. I hope that you had a fun time despite some of my struggles. I am far from an expert at this, but I really do love opening toys and I especially love when I get little dolls because they are the greatest things in the world. Whether it is morning, noon, or night, I hope you have a great rest of your day and I will see you next time.